Now, as we're starting to see that storm pull away, we have a beautiful day in store for you. Still chilly out there. This is a live look from the old mill cam. You can see plenty of clouds out there, but you've got lots of sunshine and lots of blue out there. And boy, it is crystal clear. Finally, a day where you can see downtown Salt Lake City in the distance. 35 in Salt Lake is feeling a little bit more like 31 right now. Calm breeze coming from the west, five miles per hour with temperatures in the mid 30s right now along the Wasatch Front. You're at 30 in Park City, 24 in Evanston, Bear Lake. You're still at 25 where it's chilly right now, nearing 50 in St. George. And you can see a lot of that sunshine, clear skies through central, central and southern Utah with some of those clouds hanging around northern Utah. They're going to start breaking apart. But that storm is pushing off to the east of us. We have high pressure building in. And as high pressure builds in, it's going to keep us dry and warm us up as we go into this upcoming weekend. This is really breaking down the next seven days for you. And then that next storm moves through Sunday night. We warm up. We get breezy Sunday ahead of that Sunday night into Monday. Things are turning cold and snowy and that cold air is going to be here to stay. So let's take a look at, at how things could kind of pan out as, as we go into early next week. So by Sunday night, nine o'clock, things are going to be warm ahead of the storm. So we're going to start off as a rain and snow mix in the valleys with snow developing in our northern mountains. But that's quickly going to change over to snow early Monday morning, not just up in the mountains, but down in the valleys. But snow is going to be dumping in the mountains all day. It becomes more widespread as we go into the afternoon with rain showers developing in St. George and in southern Utah that second half of the day. Snow sticks around early Tuesday morning, and then we start drying out as we go into the rest of the day. Looks like um, uh, we're going to be watching a couple different things as we go into our Tuesday. Uh, now, for today, things are going to be a bit warmer than yesterday. We're going to become a bit sunnier this afternoon. Calm breeze, low 40s. You can see those temperatures all across the water that front hovering in those low 40s right above freezing in Park City nearing 60 in St. George and tonight it's going to be another cold one folks we're dropping down to the mid 20s and in St. George you're also going to be cold in the upper 20s but things just kind of get warmer and warmer as we go into each and every day this upcoming weekend my goodness it's beautiful mid 60s with the rain on Monday and within St. George temperatures are really going to drop by Tuesday upper 40s mid 40s Wednesday in northern Utah uh, you keep warming low 50s this weekend by Monday, we've got that widespread snow for President's Day. Be prepared for travel impacts. Early Tuesday morning, snow sticks around. We'll start drying out mid-30s. Cold air is here to stay.